Hello and welcome back beautiful Aquarians. Thanks for coming by the channel. Guys, I hope you're doing well. I'm feeling a lot of positive energy, especially coming into April for whatever reason. I think it's going to be some kind of a turning point for a lot of people. Aquarius, thanks so much for your views, your likes, your comments, your subscriptions. I deeply appreciate that. Aquarius, let's see what's going on. Messages, please, for Aquarius. Aquarius, what does the universe want to reveal here to Aquarius? Energies of Aquarius, things that could be happening, advice from the universe here. Do the work. Somebody's, there's part of a sacred plan here. What's going on? Learning, chalking something up to a learning experience. Trust the universe. Listen deeply to what you, you know, your spirit guides are telling you. Like, listen deeply to what the universe is trying to communicate with you because I do believe they are. There is a sacred plan here, so you're being asked to trust the universe. Somebody has some inner work to do. Either you or someone around you. The Holy Spirit. Expect miracles. Remember that only love is real. Miracles were ne will never occur naturally. Spirit has your back. Trust the universe. They have a sacred plan for you. Oh, Odin. Psychic insights. Your third eye is open and see the truth for what it is. Follow your intuition. Odin. <laughs> I like it. Psychic insight. Radha, soul flame, rediscover the lost part of yourself, experience relationship, harmony, and healing. Ooh. Horus, cosmic gateway, your thoughts are magnetic and powerful, miraculous changes are occurring. Joan of Arc, the voice of truth, stand strong, focus on your purpose, Release the fear of persecution and speak your truth. Hmm. Higher learning. You have learned from experience. More inner study is now required to further your progress. Something big is happening here. So <laughs> you've gotten a lot of psychic insights and you're being told to trust your intuition Speak your mind. Expect miracles. What's going on here? Don't let, uh, what did it say? Don't let fear of persecution stop you from saying what it is you want to say. Stand strong. Focus on your purpose. Release that fear of persecution and speak your truth. It's almost like you don't want to say something because you're fearing like people are going to judge you or persecute you for whatever it is you're saying. Spirit's saying there is peace here. Manifesting peace. Destiny. There, trust the universe. There is a sacred plan here. Ooh. See, that's that evil eye, you know, someone keeping an eye on you or keeping a steady eye on you, just waiting to persecute you for opening up your mouth. Spirit saying, open up your mouth. Speak your truth. Don't worry about these people that are lurking in the shadows, what they're going to say. Hell to that noise. Aquarius, what's going on here? Oh, 
It's like the evil eye watching you. You know what I mean? Someone keeping an eye on you, like monitoring you somehow. Speak your truth. Don't worry what people think. Hmm. Something to do with the East. Forest bathing, like soak up the, this is getting grounded, nurturing yourself. What is this all about? Getting back into your, yeah, run with the wolves. Run free, man. Speak your truth. Don't worry about these evil eyes. <laughs> The womb, nurturing, self-love, growth, development. It's a spiritual journey, man. It's all learning. You're a warrior. Speak your truth. Hmm. Hmm. Inner healer. Someone needs to heal their inner self. Nurture their self. Don't freaking worry what other people say. Evil eye. You know, always watching and lurking. <laughs> to hell with them. Just saying, Aquarius. You know, we're only here once. Speak your truth. Don't be afraid of persecution, what people will think of you, say about you. Who cares? It's your journey. It's your truth. No one else's. It's a huge achievement. A great achievement. It's like whatever conflict Spirit is assuring you, you're going to have peace. You have achieved a great deal by being a warrior, by speaking your truth. It's all about teaching, learning, learning experiences. And you're very deserving of this piece, very deserving of obviously, Spirit is saying there's a sacred plan here. Hang on here. It's all for this. You know, trust the universe. The universe has a plan. And it's listening to your inner truth and what it is that you want to do, who you want to be, what you want to say. It's a huge ass milestone. Following the honored path. Spirit saying you've been playing it safe. Speak your truth. Could be to do with family. Intentions. Hidden motives, family, friends, and guides are all around you. You're on the increase, man. You've hit a major milestone. 
And now this person is sitting over here in victim mentality, in conflict, playing the victim. Always keeping a watchful eye out. They're so happy where they are, where are they watching you? Maybe you did speak your truth, Aquarius, and maybe they don't like it. I think you stood up for yourself. I think you were playing it safe for a while. I think you decided you were going to speak up for yourself. Trusting your intuition, your manifesting peace, happiness, friends, family, guides. You're on the increase, man, and they are definitely feeling like the victim. Mm. Playing victim? I don't know. Aquarius advice for the beautiful Aquariuses, the high achieving Aquariuses, trusting the universe, trusting the sacred plan, whatever it is, what's going on. Yeah, see, boom. Trapped in fear, feeling like victim, feeling like Maybe they tried to trap you in fear. Or maybe you were afraid to speak your truth. I don't think you are. There's been heartache and loss here. A huge tower. A disruption. Somebody being stubborn. I don't know. Maybe they're... Whatever. You're getting a victory and a success. A triumphant success. There's that sort of truth. Getting fulfillment of wishes. This person over here is going to start to see some financial and material changes. And not in a good way. Trust the universe has your back. Patience. Patience. All things come together in due time, in perfect timing. Not a day before, not a day later, in divine perfect timing. Positive movement forward. Hmm. Taking charge back of your own life. There's been an ending. You know, there could have actually been a death. But here you are. That spiritual warrior. That wounded warrior. <laughs> Didn't keep you down. Hurt you. But this is a warrior now. Hmm. Taking a leadership role here. Maybe you're in a leadership role. Ooh. King of coins here. What's going on? Oh. Well, maybe somebody's manifesting a great achievement. Maybe somebody is manifesting a bunch of coins here stability maybe somebody was manipulative and maybe somebody decided to be manipulative took leadership about some kind of financial situation here maybe they were i don't know let's see Here's romance coming in. What's going on? Hmm. 
It's like the missing piece. It's like feeling uh, rejected or feeling, you know, if you're missing some kind of cup here, it's coming in. What's going on? Mm-hmm. That's the law of polarity here. The chariot, powerful, strong, taking control back. Guiding your chariot in the way you want it to go, Aquarius. There's been some hurt here, but you're healing. Somebody very toxic. Somebody very uh, devil energy, man. It's never good. You know what I mean? Unless you're a Capricorn. Devil energy could be, you know... Codependency, toxicity, greed, too much of anything that is not good for you. Somebody decided to move the hell on, wanting peace. Divine timing here, patience, balance, playing it safe, you know. I'm going to let the universe handle this. I'm going to let the universe, the universe got my back. Everything in divine timing. Hmm. Set your sights and your intentions in a new direction. Now this could have been some kind of messaging sent out against you that has hurt you. Or some information or news that has come to you that has hurt you. Somebody needs to do some inner work. Now this could be a new idea. A great achievement that you've done. You're like uh, passionate about whatever it is you're passionate about something fulfillment of wishes is yours this could be inspired again on a new beginning and quickly moving past whatever this was i don't know it is setting your sights higher this is healing that's your own energy. Wow. Just heading on your north node here. Moving forward, listening to your intuition, healing, being guided. Hmm. Lessons learned. There is love here. But it's almost as if I know you have love in your life. And I know you're very loving and compassionate. So why did this person figure that they could choose materialistic things over love? Juggling the finances around here or juggling period. That's a power struggle. That's their own internal battle. Immaturity. Told you. 
in the shadows there is a lurker you know they're always spying on you always looking to gather information about you immature it's caused a lot of emotions to flow over there's you know a lot of sadness here I don't know if this has brought shame upon you or they should be ashamed or they are ashamed or maybe they're looking to see if you're sad crying over them Aquarius <laughs> you just turned your back you know look toward your future there are a lot of fond memories here now you're just looking shooting your star here to your wish fulfillment there is a miracle there is a blessing coming in a great achievement maybe you the achievement is is that you turned your back <laughs> and are focusing in on your own destiny your own life your own wishes Empress energy, nurturing, loving, caring, compassionate, very fruitful, abundant. Look at you go, man. <laughs> Looks like you set your sights on yourself and are achieving a great, this is a great achievement. You know, whether you're masculine or feminine, it really doesn't matter. When you focus in on your own wishes, on your own fulfillment, it's funny how eventually people keep, you know, lurking and spying on you to see if you're still shedding a tear. Well, I don't see any tears shed here. I think you're focusing in on your relationship, your children, your growth, your wish fulfillment. There's only two people in that card. And I see everybody smiling here. Funny, the three cups spilt over, but these are the two that are standing remaining. Slow and steady wins the race here. True love. That's unconditional love. That is loving selflessly. Don't let these evil eye people cheat you out of your blessings, your fulfillment. Look at you. It, it's like, you know, they want to go and do this seven of swords thing whether that's stealing money stealing your time stealing your energy your resources it don't matter you keep focusing in on you and let these people lurking spying evil eye get their own i just think aquarius is letting the universe take care of it all because I just see that you're focusing in on your happiness. I don't see no tears over there. If they are, they're tears of joy. I 
look pretty content over there. Oh, what's this? An emperor. An emperor does not have to mean, you know, it could just be that someone was very stubborn. Takes a long time to learn a lesson. I don't know. Somebody took a risk. And somebody walked away. And they're like, is this a knight in shining armor? Someone coming in to the rescue. Someone mad, resentful, angry that you walked away to fill up your own cups. They shouldn't have let you get away then. But you trusted your intuition. Okay. <laughs> let them be greedy. They want to steal. Let them steal. They can't steal this. They can't steal this happiness. These blessings. This beautiful, divinely guided person. Would they steal? What'd they get out of stealing? They got the devil? That's extreme greed. That's extreme... Extreme. Figuring that they can cheat somebody out of their money or time or energy. Very greedy, very selfish, no matter how you look at it. And now they're pissed off that you walked away. <laughs> Creating all these burdens. Self-fulfilling is like taking the cups of others just to fill up their own. Take, 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 fill up my own cup here. Well, that's stealing. You know, whether it's love, your emotions, just gimme, 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 never gets. They're weak. They took the coward's way out. It's what they did. They took the coward's way out. Giving and receiving. All the hands are out here. You know what I mean? Take, 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 take. Someone has inner work to do, you know what I mean? Or maybe someone just said, you know, I'm tired of this. I'll be, I'd rather be alone than with an energy like that. I would rather be alone than deal with that. I don't know if there is fear here or there is a trapped energy. Might have made you worry a lot. But the good news is here, you've learned to defend yourself. You've learned to stand your ground. This person could have slung a lot of accusations at you and you stood your ground. 
They're very, very unloving. <laughs> Looks like you have love, though. And if you don't, it's certainly here. Happy family, happy life. Happy wife, happy situation. Hmm. They're going through, maybe this person left you broke out the cold. It's like somebody saying, you know, I'm not going to beg for anybody's affections. I'm not begging. I'm not begging. It's not worth it. Somebody just said, you know, I'm done. I'm done with the fighting. I'm done with the battle. I'm tired of the war. I'm done. It's not going anywhere. It's just stuck energy. Very immature. Fake ass apologies. <laughs> You're just like, you know what? Comes around and goes around. Looks like you're being blessed with a lot of happiness and joy, but it doesn't look so great over there. So what good did their thievery do them? You know, they self-sabotaged. They will self-destruct with that mentality. Up late at night. Oh, that's consequences. Ah, Aquarius, speaking your truth. Your truth. Your true, authentic self. You probably told this person what comes around goes around. You probably told this person you gave them a piece of your mind. You know what I mean? When that Aquarian energy sword hits, that's the sword of truth. Comes around, goes around. Hmm. Player energy. Deny everything. They can deny all they want to deny. The truth is the truth. It is crystal clear. There is no confusion. It never changes. It's consistent. They gotta reap what they've sown. Just whatever. You're celebrating, focusing in on your stability. You work like a team. It is a collaboration. Spirit has your back. Again, they can be in this secretive energy all they want. Because they're only hurting themselves anyway. Truth is, you know, you can't deny the truth. The truth is the truth. This is justice. Balancing out the scales here. Taking a leadership role. Good on you. 
seeing your own value, your own worth. You know, this hurt. This was painful. But you're the one victorious. That's why you have stability. That's why you have the wealth that this person doesn't have. Look, this is happiness. This is true wealth. A happy home, a happy life, a happy family. You have been blessed and you know how to count your blessings. You're loving, you're nurturing. These are all your wish fulfillment. You know your worth, your value. That's why you're victorious. Mm. Judgment Day. Wow, there you go. Let the shit hit the fan. Standing in your true, authentic self. Truth is truth. There you go. To be real here, I could be dealing with uh, two similar energies. Sword signs, you know? Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. I could be dealing with two Aquariuses, for all I know. All I can tell you is Judgment Day is here. And the truth. Always is revealed. Can't hide from the universe. Judgment is judgment. They will be judged for their actions and you have made a decision to have a beautiful life. That is true wealth that money cannot buy. Genuine happiness Happy times, people around you, friends, family, guides, security, love and respect from the people that you're with. That's true wealth. But I can tell you, you are being blessed. Because Spirit has a sacred plan here to reward you. <laughs> Just saying. What'd they get out of the deal? You know, a few pentacles. What'd they get out of it? Not a lot. A few pentacles. That's it. They'll do all this hurting for a few pentacles. Hmm. Didn't look worth it to me when you got all this. Take care, Aquarius. Good on you, man. Good on you. Let all these onlookers look. Because when they look, this is what they see. Happiness, joy, contentment, love, high honor, high respect, dignity. That's what you have. Dignity, high honor, high respect. They cannot say that. That cannot be said here. But you do. Take care. Good luck.